Hey everyone, this is Crystal from EnderWigan.net. Um, this is my first uh, vlog. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to call it yet. I was thinking maybe the Weekly Ender and my friend told me that maybe if I call it the Weekly Ender then I should do it on Fridays or Saturdays or something because then it's like the end of the week, you know, Weekly Ender. So we'll see. Um, if any of you have a better idea of what I can call this thing, um, I'm all ears. So. Uh, today is Tuesday, May 7th, 2013. Uh, today we got to see the Ender's Game trailer, something that I've been waiting for for over 20 years. So it was quite an occasion and I'm actually kind of sad it's over now because over the last week I'd been building a lot of anxiety and yesterday um, I was so nervous I had a hard time sleeping and um, Today we got to do the Google Hangout with uh, director Gavin Hood, Asa Butterfield, and reporter O.C. Um, it was a lot of fun. It was a great experience and I want to thank Summit uh, for, for giving fan sites the opportunity to do that because um, I was just blown away by the chance that they gave us to ask questions and interact with them and yeah, it was, it was awesome. Um, I was a little bummed that we didn't get to see the trailer before uh, we did that, that hangout because I had been anticipating I guess along with everybody else everybody else was counting down and I thought we were going to get to see the trailer right then and then go into the hangout but then it turned out that we weren't going to get to see it until after so like the whole time I kept thinking I, I want this to keep going so that I can keep talking to him but at the same time I really want to get off this and watch the trailer but um yeah it was it was a lot of fun it was kind of nerve-wracking I mean oh I, I have no idea how many people watched it and I don't think very many people are gonna watch these videos so I don't feel as bad doing these but yeah, I feel like a lot of people watch that one, so that kind of makes me feel ill. Uh, so for the trailer, um, it, it's so much to take in. I, I, I still have to go back and do caps and look at everything, but I mean, they showed so much and yet they still kept it to a pretty tight storyline, which I really liked. Uh, I liked the alien, the, the formic, they showed the big motherships and they showed just how many numbers they had um, in their battles with the humans. Um, I really like the music. Um, I, I know I, I saw a couple people keep, I saw a couple people complaining about the music, but to me I found it exciting. I like sci-fi trailers to have that low booming kind of in, intense kind of feeling to the music so I really like that part um, we saw a lot of good shots of Ender um, I'm a little confused about what him and Petra were doing there's a part where you see Petra running outside what looks like Eros she's not wearing a suit um, she's carrying two backpacks I think um, and then they, before that they had shown two people looking at something. I don't know if that's part of the mind game or if that's a new scene or something, but I guess, I don't know, I guess we'll see. Okay, I want to keep this kind of short, uh, so I'm going to wrap up and I just want to say to catch up on all your news on the movie, uh, you can go to my site, enderwagon.net. Uh, I host a podcast with Kelly from Ender News called Endercast. You can go to that at www.endercast.com or you can find us on iTunes and um, I had actually made this for today but I didn't think you could see it on the wall so I didn't put it on the wall maybe I'll put it on the wall from now on but yeah here's my Twitter thing I cut out this little bird last night my son calls it my tweeter <laughs> okay thanks for watching